Hello, I'm David Rattenborough, acclaimed documentary filmmaker, teapot collector, and political prisoner. Five years ago, I made a film at a high school, and that is all I'm legally allowed to say. Due to filming complications, I had to stay at the Soap Slum Correctional Facility, which my publicist insists is a one-star luxury resort. And when I left the said facility, I was, um, how do you say, given a souvenir, an electronic ankle bracelet. As I am rehabilitated into society, I am not allowed to leave my house, but if you would think that would stop me from making high-quality, subpar documentaries, you would sorely be wrong. So, now I show the first and my smashing presentation. Uh, Wednesday grocery supplement. Every Wednesday, a white van comes to my house to deliver my weekly groceries. I wait in my shower with the hope my groceries will be left behind without me having to talk to someone. Shower cubicles such as this one here are perfect for hiding from parole officers and food delivery men. After waiting for a length of time comparable to an Ibis's mating dance, I'm convinced the delivery man has left. I approach with great caution, making sure I am not observed by my neighbours. In today's food bag, we have Baculus vinulos, Gelius cristialis, Canios fishybird, and Microbavus rice coupe. And that is all. Once receiving the hamper, the wild beast, which in this case is myself, takes off the meal of the week. As a fussy eater, I don't like the baked beans. I tend to use them as eye coolers. Oh, that's the stuff. The jelly is great flavoring to add to our otherwise bland meal of tuna and rice. I'm able to partake of this meal twice in a week. Being my only meals, I must conserve my energy by doing only the easiest of crosswords. Let's get cooking. First, remove the rice from its plastic prison, place in a bowl, and leave to fester. Sloppily add the tuna in an uncouth fashion, avoiding areas outside the bowl. Hastily remove the jelly crystals from the packet. After unsuccessfully trying to open the packet with your hands, find your nearest pair of uncontaminated scissors and finish the job. Garnish generously with the jelly crystals, and then serve within five days. And there you have it. How to make an affordable meal for yourself. Okay, bon appetit. Surprisingly fruity. Delectable. You can really taste the lemon. So if you want to impress your significant other, business associate, or parole officer, why not serve them tuna for one? <laughs>